Okay, so you got a hula hoop gadget. You might want to practice with this one. Nope. Okay. It's also pretty easy to control. It's just... Oh, you got to capture a le 9 out of 11 monkeys in this one. Mm. So we're going in. We're going deeper, deeper Leo. Mm -hmm. Nice, timely Inception reference. Okay, so basically those ramp ones where that monkey was, you can't walk up those because it's too steep, so you'll need the hula hoop. Okay, let's hula our way to victory. Okay, so now when you put it on, you have to re rotate the thing super fast. What? 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 Why? Yeah. Why? Yeah. What? Yeah. Why? <laughs> and that'll let you get to places a bit faster. <laughs> It also works as if you run into things with it, it stuns them. No, hold on, hold on. We're going back here. So, I hula my way to victory and then I become Sonic. Cool. Yeah, All right. it's a little hard to control when you're like actually going that fast, uh, but it's pretty uh, easy to start up and you will get used to it pretty fast. I really want to one day do this. Hula with my arms pulled straight back, just running through field going... I'm the, free, the super free hula hoop as the thing. wind blows, free as the grass I'm wondering blows. how it's, like, sharp enough to cut through robots, though. I'm sorry, is that the questions we should be asking yeah. ourselves right now? How could a hula... Oh, I'm sorry, excuse me. Just kidding. Come here, you monk bastard. <laughs> yeah. Call me a monkey's uncle, because I'm gonna capture you. Pogo. With a hula hoop. Oh, shut up. Don't <laughs> you start. We don't need this right now. There's a monkey. Hey, how's it going? How's it going? Oh, yeah. It's going good, right? I forgot that the um, jet blue pants, like the dark blue pants, mean that they run super fast. Oh, They're more boy. athletic. Alright. That's so another reason we need why this. they that's another reason why they introduced this thing. There you go. Billy. Where's his pun? If his name was Gump, that would have been hilarious. <laughs> run, Forrest! Run! Oh, I got it. Uh, let me see, is there... Doot. Nope, they're all inside. Alright. Caught all of them out here. But yeah, sometimes you have to return to a level with a new gadget to capture them. Okay, so... I'm just pointing out a simple observation. I can smack them with this. Or the lightsaber. I can smack them with this. Well, you can't I smack can them with the net. You can only capture them with the net. Well, I mean, it's still something to manipulate. To grab them. Yeah. Basically, I find... How come I can't club them over the head with the radar? Because you don't want to damage it. It's electronics. Yeah, semantics. I'd still do it. So he's a super fast one. Yeah, so fast. Carlito. Oh, God. Wow, this game just got more racist. <laughs> well, I mean, we already talked about the Black Pants uh, Watergate theory we've got going on. Well, you gotta remember, this game was made in a different time. Um, it's also made in Japan. That's true. And Japan don't give a fuck. Smack yo! Yo, like, my like, look at the angry tomato birds. Like, that's not a clear ripoff. Uh, well... I'd still... Oh, right. Yeah, so, obviously, since this is the beginning, it's not that hard of a game. Uh -huh. But it does get to points where you have to actually use this thing and be precise because you're on a narrow pathway. Of course it would. Oh, right. Okay, I get it now. Yeah, this is just trying to teach you now without, like, death as a failure option that you're going to have to use that and actually be able to control it good. Alright. I'm doing things to this controller that shouldn't be done. <laughs> that I've never done to another person before. <laughs> well. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Jeez, um, okay. Yeah. Alright, alright, I get it. This is where the skill starts to come into play. However, you probably won't really need too much skill until probably like level 5 of 10. I think there's usually 10 worlds in each game like this. Bastard. He can't really get down from there without falling himself, so you got him on that little area. It's a dude named Bridget? He's on a bridge. <laughs> Actually, what'd you call this? what would you call the thing that's sticking out of the top of the house with... Um, Miranda? Yeah, uh, windows with, walk? With, without a window or any way to get on top of it. I didn't say it was a good veranda. I was thinking, like, maybe they started building a bridge and they're like, fuck it. <laughs> well, I mean, there's a bridge right there, so what? Did they build part of the bridge and go, oh, he was, uh, he was out looking to the bridge. 
more sheep. Oh, it's a it's a loot. Uh, no, not a loot door. What what are they called? Uh, Mac bullfighter. Bull yeah, it's a ma match door or something like that. Magic. Ole. Oh my <laughs> day! Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, this is punion ringlicious. All right. You gotta love punions. Uh, let's let's not. This game's already gone. That's just a button. Oh, there you go. You got a platform now. What, I can just have that? Yep. So when I was up there... No, it I... keeps moving up and down. <laughs> I never knew um, Spain had one of these moving floors. What? That Spain's got elevators? Moving floors. Escalators? Um, you might want to push that block onto that. Onto the button. So, wait, hold on. This thing looks gigantic, and this eight-year-old can just... It's cardboard. <laughs> you know what? Remember when I started trying to put lodging to this? Just cancel all that. No more. Well, we're talking about monkeys taking over the world here. I don't think uh, logic has a place. We're talking about emo punk turks who got chassis belts over their head. I think if you break that box, you'll find a monkey. Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. There you go. Chutney. Hey, I make that. <laughs> okay, now I'm hungry. Damn it! Isn't chutney like a Spanish thing though? Chutney. Eh, possibly. I know it's made with fruit preservatives. It's it's one of those things where it depends on what your tastes are. You can make it up like spicy, yeah, spicy, savory, uh, bitter, bitter, both sour, sweet, sweet if you. Uh, or for that. You can even make it sweet and salty. Did that guy just pull out a bomb? I thought he pulled out a shield. Allison? Um, I don't get that one. I think some, most of them are puns, but some of them just aren't. They, they kind of ran just, out of puns. Some of them were just phoned in. Yeah. I don't get the question. Maybe the question mark one means like this one was hidden. This was a hard one to find. <laughs> okay. Oh. Defeat one monkey. You're fighting Monkey Blue. One of the monkey, Freaky Monkey Five. So am I just going to bash him over the head? And it's a boss fight. So I'm going to bash him over the head. Excellent. Mm. We'll see. It looks like a racetrack. Oh, no. Uh, I, do I have to hula hoop my way to victory? Probably. Good. Is he on a bike? It, no, it's a... It's... <laughs> I want one. Um... Don't take it personal, kid. I'm doing this for all the little monkeys out there. I want whatever he's riding. It looks like a motor unicycle. I want... I want whatever he's on. God damn. Sorry, kid. Yeah, the Freaky Monkey 5 are, like, also more intelligent than the regular monkeys. And stronger. I think you gotta hit him, maybe? Um... Yeah, there you go. But he's not gonna stay down until, like, a few hits, obviously. Yeah, I see. Yeah, it looks like he's throwing bombs. Okay. What? I don't get it? There you go. So what? We're playing red light, green light? Something like that. What happens if I go in where it's red? You die? <laughs> I don't know. D T Aw. Told you, this is the one that I haven't actually played. Alright, let's do the thing. Oh, God, no. Oh, well, you screwed yourself there. Oh, God, no. You don't gotta keep spinning it, you know that, right? Oh, it's just... Uh oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, his helmet's yellow, so once it goes red, it means you'll be able to capture him. You only got, like, one health left, though, buddy. Well, you know. I just figured that I don't have to... Ooh. Oh, my. <laughs> oh, my. Hip thrust, hip thrust. Yeah, so I think he's, like, one more hit away from when you can start capturing him. Oh. Or something like that. Not 100% sure on how he works, I just know that when the boss fight's helmet turns red, it means their health is low. Oh god, no. 
Hey, a cookie. Yoink. Then there might be one on the other one. Yeah. I don't know for sure, but I tend to find out. Nope. Damn it! Yellow, red. Well, at least he follows traffic signals. Yeah, that's true. At least he's smart enough to do that. Okay, maybe one more hit then, since it's still yellow. Maybe it's three. Maybe it's three hits per color. Maybe. On. Oh boy. Okay. Someone went a little crazy with the grenades. Oh no 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 no. Cap. Oh no. Hmm. Yeah. Maybe maybe it's three more hits, one red, and then he's just like capture me now. Yeah, I'm totally. Yeah, I think maybe because I'm looking at. It these. took three hits to get him down to yellow, and it took three hits to get him down to red. Oh no! There you go. It was one. capture him. Can't change. Hey. <laughs> I was just batting him over the head. <laughs> I was like, how are you missing? <laughs> yeah, you caught monkey blue. There's also monkey white, monkey red, monkey pink, and monkey yellow. Now, this doesn't mean anything, but I'm curious just to be acquainted with monkey pink. Also, they're all super racist, because monkey blue, as you saw, was like totally an American. Monkey yellow is a ninja. I thought they were going somewhere else with that. Okay. Monkey pink is? Monkey pink is actually Saudi Arabian. At least if that's how it goes from the uh, the third game. Because, um, like I said, she's speak no evil, so she sings. That's her power. She sings at you. Is that a Saudi Arabian thing? I don't know. But I think... But she mostly has, like, um... All of her background dancers are like those like do 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 kind of people. What you mean do 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 kind of people? <laughs> you know where they go like this and they have like the big puffy pants. You know, like Aladdin style pants. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah, like that. Oh, them. And Monkey Red is all um, kung fu style. Oh. Monkey White's like a super smart guy. What race is he? White. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm talking about generic standards that people, you know, like, white supremacy that people had, because apparently the white man is the smart one, who's supposed to make a lot of money back in the days. Uh-huh. Of, like, 1999 when this game existed. <laughs> Wait, this was 1999? Probably something like that. Huh. Let me, let me search it up. I know that... The first one was for PS1, and that was like 1990-something. Let's see here. Google. Okay, question. Why are their chairs just doing their thing here? Ah, uh, Because fuck you. No, oh, well. Alright, maybe later. Okay. Ape Escape 2? Oh, God. What happened? Nothing, nothing. We're doing good. Continue researching. July 18th, 2002 is when Ape Escape 2 came out. So, huh. take that. Take it. And Ape Escape 1... What is that? What is what? The bird? The candle bird? No, that ape had like a full set of armor. Oh, uh, maybe because you're in a medieval kind of level. Uh, I, medieval maybe. This is like a haunted, a haunted mansion sort of looking deal. What? Oh. Oh. I got a pity cookie. <laughs> oh, oh, you son of a. Whatever works, right? Ape Escape One was 1999. So 1999, 2002, and 2003 are when the three Ape Escape games came out. I feel like I'm retarded, because I can't get this thing. Alright, there you go. Bang. Mm. What? I hit you. I smacked you over the head. You should be senseless right now. Well, you didn't really smack him in the head. You smacked him in the gut with your hoo -hoo. But you're almost dead. You got one monkey Ote. <laughs> oh! <laughs> you got one hit left in you. I want... Hold on. You see what I see on the other end there? Uh, maybe try hitting it with something. 
not the hula hoop. Because <laughs> if you fall in the fire, you might die. Well, no, no, no. I'm thinking. What about that picture that looked really messed up? <laughs> uh, sorry, I was just what? Oh, you're dead. I sure am. Well, luckily, you got lives though. I have lives. Yeah. Oh. There you go. You got two lives left, or two protection vests, as I would call them. Sir, I'm just gonna soak this one in for a little bit. <laughs> He's like, he'll never catch me now. Okay, so what's the bets? You've never played this, and I certainly have never played this. What do you think that one's called? Monkey Lisa. Monkey Lisa. Can't think of something better, or maybe even Monk Lisa or something. Hmm. I was gonna say something smarter, like something Simeon lined, but that's nah, screw it. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Looks like Monkey Lisa has something on you. If his name is not Monkey Lisa, I'm gonna be very disappointed in this game, actually. <laughs> wow, <laughs> monkey crap! Come here, yeah. Okay. Van, Van Gogh. What? Van Gogh. Wait, was it Van Gogh that drew the Mona Lisa? Um... I don't think so. Yeah. I thought that was Da Vinci. Yeah, that was a Da Vinci thing. I'm gonna oh. look that up. Ah, uh, I'm retarded. <laughs> right into the fire. <laughs> well, I thought, you know, you're going fast enough. Yeah, boy. Are those monkey scythes? Uh, no, those are banana scythes. There's not monkeys on them. Sorry, that's why I meant. Um. Okay. Yeah, Leonardo da Vinci. That didn't make much sense then. So <laughs> Unless they're going for like either being stupid, or if the whole re. Sorry. Yes. Sorry to interrupt. Shit just happened. <laughs> I don't know about you, but I would not sleep on a bed covered like being held up by a skeleton hand. I wouldn't sleep in a bed that's got a monkey in it, but. Apparently that's what this game wants. Nine more monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and got fucked up. But yeah, like, I would have called it. What the does that have to do with bed related? I'm getting very dis. <laughs> I know I'm supposed to hate puns, <laughs> but now you but want them. <laughs> but I expect them. I expect them to be here so I can be disappointed at them. What if we're just on. so stupid we don't understand the puns? Uh, no, no. Can't happen. What's this monkey getting called? He was in a coffin. Oh, he throws bombs! I think. There are some monkeys, too, that have, like, rocket packs on their back that shoot rockets out at you. They're usually the ones with crazy goggles. Again, this camera control is, like, the stuff of legends. Yeah, but you'll play... I think he's just over there by the scythes. I see him. But you'll play like an N64 game and be like, oh wow, these controls are gonna count Moncula. There we go, I'm disappointed already. <laughs> oh man, I, I just wish like you saw a picture of Count Chocula there. Now, I'm. it seems that this thing is going for like a horror sort of This fun. seems to be like a horror level, yeah. Although I know in the third one, they got an even better one because there's like a, a monkey with a hockey mask on and a machete. Is that a, a, a fridge with bananas? And wine. Yeah, I was gonna say banana wine. Banana rum, I mean. <laughs> banana liqueur. Banana liqueur. Mm, banana liqueur. Banana liqueur smoothie. Sounds delicious, right? What is that? Um. I don't know. Well, I guess we'll find out. Not a damn clue. Next time on Dragon Ball Z. Oh, come on. Now you want their endorsement? <laughs> hey, Dragon Ball Z is awesome. It is. Why do you walk into their hits? I thought he was further away, just because of where the, uh... Mother... Ugh. Three hits left. Oh, <laughs> uh, it's so entertaining to watch. I'm sure it is. I'm sure the good people at home are 
being thoroughly entertained by how absolute batshit crap I am. Mother! Two dead. hits left. There you go. Sorry, I had to s pierce. <laughs> His right. drill will pierce the heavens. Oh god, no. Okay. Hold on. I'm going back up there because there was an underground, and I'm a fan of the underground. Are you a fan of the underground movement? Okay, let's uh, move on. Oh. There's okay. two monkeys there. And there's, they're in a banana boat. There's two monkeys. Banana... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's soak this one in, because I have a feeling. Okay. It's a banana that looks like it's been curved up, so this is obviously Frankenstein related. So. Uh. Names. What, what do we think for names? Um... I actually have no clue for this one. Come here. Oh, one hit. Yeah. You're dead. I sure am. Nope, I've got my pity cookie. Oh. How did you get that? Pity cookie. It's a thing. I never knew about that. I only know about that. Okay. Hide. Hide. If you're Jekyll... Uh, no, 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 he's gonna be Frank and... Nana. Banana? No, no, I got it, it's just... Why is that here? Hide Nana? Uh-oh. Nana hide? Oh. Uh, Nana hide ducks. Well, I, I don't know what else to name him, I just... Mm. Dude. That, that's why I said I had no idea what their names could be. I was thinking like Dr. Franken-Banana or something like that. <laughs> Franken-Nana. I was gonna say 